So we're talking about the lashes. my love welcome or welcome back to my channel your girl is back with another video i know you guys haven't seen my face in a long time your girl is just trying to figure things out y'all life be lifing and life be trying to take your girl by the throat so just bear with me bear with my inconsistency right now like i've been very inconsistent i'm trying to figure out ways to keep things afloat and to just achieve my goals and all of that good stuff but right now your girl is getting ready for a nail appointment i'm about to get my nails done because they're looking very ragged right now. The girl is looking busted, dusted, and crusted right now. But yeah, we're going to get it together. But yeah, I have my nail appointment at 11. I already ordered myself a cab. It is currently 10.28 a.m. If this is focusing. I'm just here waiting on my cab to come. And then I'm going to leave out for my nail appointment. I actually want to be on time. So that I can like set up and make some content as well. I'm trying to film for TikTok and Instagram as well as YouTube. But I'm going to just chill and finish watching Dynasty. And then I'll catch you guys. Yeah. Okay. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. I could not get back on camera yesterday, y'all, when I got home. Like, I was so beat. I was at ta year okay like the day wore me out and i still haven't recovered it's literally 9 34 i have my hair appointment at 10 today so i'm about to start getting ready now because my cab is gonna pick me up at around like 9 45 so i only have like 15 minutes to get ready so i'm just gonna do my skincare routine brush my teeth to wash my face do the whole works this is how my nails turned out y'all so i did gold chrome french tips and it's giving it's a vibe like I love it. The girl that did my nails, she is actually a beginner. And uh, y'all, like, look at this. Like, the shape, the chrome, everything. Like, the application is so nice. I really enjoyed my service. She was so professional. We related on so many things. She's also Jamaica, and I love supporting my people. The whole entire experience was a vibe. I'm gonna get ready because my, my, my cab is about to be here. I'll see you guys at my hair appointment because... Yeah, it's 9.38 now and I'm just chatting and I need to get ready. try and set you guys up on my bootleg tripod my tabletop tripod i think i mentioned this in one of my videos hold on let me try and set you guys up my tabletop tripod actually got broken but i'm literally having to do these ghetto ass setup for you guys when i'm filming because i don't have any tabletop tripod anymore but anyways y'all this is it here this is her i'm really loving it i saw it in a so flat and nice and y'all can we talk about the inches like 
Let's talk about the inches, okay? I've never gotten my hair this long before. Like the max length I've ever had in my head was 26 inch. I think that's the most are 24. Between 24 to 26 inches, one out of them. The lengths that I have in my head are 26, 28, and 30. Like I've never gotten 30 inch. Always wanted to have 30 inch though, but yeah, I'm loving my bust down middle part. You know, so in it's giving. I was gonna do some curry shrimp today. I don't know if I'm still gonna do it. Maybe, maybe not. But I mean, I'm home for the whole week because I'm on spring break. <laughs> so if I don't get to cook today, I can cook tomorrow. But anyways, y'all, I'm gonna try and see if I can put away these groceries. I have a whole bunch of groceries to put away that I bought yesterday. I started putting them away last night, but then I was so tired that I just left like all the stuff that doesn't need to be in the refrigerator right away. And then kind of like get my house together because it's not a mess, but it's kind of looking like a little bit all over the place but i'm not gonna put that in this video because as i said this video is all about like my spring break maintenance so yeah that's not gonna be a part of this video but yeah i'll catch you guys tomorrow like we have one last appointment that is my lash appointment for tomorrow i'm super excited about that i haven't gotten like professional lash extension since august like august was the last time i got professional lash extensions and that was when i was going to jamaica so i'm excited to see my lash tech I haven't seen her in a while i also love her personality like i really vibe with her so yeah i'm excited to get some lashes <laughs> like Listen, the inches is giving, okay? Like, it's giving me, you're that girl, mm hmm Like, I just love when my hair is freshly done. Like, it just gives me that bad girl energy. Like, come on now, like, don't play. I love getting me some maintenance and I don't do this thing called maintenance often. I mean, I, I kind of like do my own maintenance with my own hair or I'll do some press on nails. But when I can, you know, like really take the time out to save money and put aside money to just go get myself pampered and maintained. I don't have to go to the hassle and tassel and bustle to actually do my maintenance on my own. Like, yeah that gives but yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow bye dreavy in the cut <laughs> i'm such a clone but hey y'all it is a brand new day it's currently monday march 18 and your girl is out here out and about i just came from icbc which is our local driving driving licensing office i had to go change my name on my health card my identity card as well as my driver's license because as you all know i'm married so i had to go update my name and add my, my married name to my ids because they weren't on there and i've been married for almost a year now so what does that say about me priorities 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 i'm actually a couple blocks away from the licensing office right now i'm by the landmark buildings if you live in Kelowna, then you know exactly where i'm talking about this is where like all of the cool high-rising buildings are like the more modernized buildings in the city i walk this way because it's closer to my home and i'm just walking home just to kill some time because i have my appointment my lash appointment is at one today and it's currently 11 20 1 a.m. So I'm just killing some time, you know, chilling here before I take a taxi to my lash appointment. But your girl is starving, so I'm kind of trying to figure out where I want to go have like a quick little lunch or a smoothie because there are lots of cool eating spots around this area. I've always wanted to try one, so I'm about to go see where I can get something to eat because your girl is starving. And uh, <laughs> yeah, All right, yeah, so let's go see what we can grab y'all and like your girl is getting out of her comfort zone like what i'm literally vlogging in public y'all like people like people that are in corporate corporate working people are literally passing by me and i'm just here holding up my camera they're looking at me but listen i don't give a damn
Alright y'all, so I'm back home for a little bit. I just came home to put down my documents because I literally don't like traveling with important documents on me. I already ordered me a cab. It's currently 12. I'm out of breath y'all. I'm so tired. It's currently 12.35. The taxi will be here in a couple of minutes. The app said that there is a driver on the way. I don't want to be late because I'm just not a late girly. I'm very big on punctuality and I hate being late for my appointments. Alright you guys, the taxi is here so I'm about to head out. I'll see you guys at the last appointment. it is a lot of days later <laughs> you guys won't even believe what day it is the last time i talked to you guys was on monday and today is saturday it's the end of the week y'all but I do have a good explanation as to why I'm just not coming back on camera. I actually run out of space on my memory card and I had to delete some footages. And also, my memory card is with me. I had two memory cards, y'all. One of them broke during Christmas time. And then this is the last one that I have left back. This memory card is a total of 256 gigs. I realized the other day, I think it was on Tuesday, that it was actually starting to break. Just like the other one did. It now has a crack at the top. And when I put it in my camera, it was starting to say that the memory card is not reading. I got pissed off and I decided to order another memory card from Amazon. I ordered a memory card. I also ordered some relaxer some olive oil ear relaxer and i had to also order a memory card reader because my memory card reader also broke so that is one of the reasons why i haven't been posting because i had no memory card reader for me to transfer my footages from the memory card to my computer so i could edit so now that i got a new memory card reader i was editing the footages that i already have this is a volume set that my lash tech did on me don't even watch the dark circles around my eyes i have not been sleeping you know i don't really like self-diagnose but a part of me feels like i have some sort of sleep disorder i'm so easy to go to sleep at night but during the day i can't sleep and i can't sleep past 6 30. i've spoken about this a few times on my channel i don't know what's going on and so right now my head is hurting me because i've been going to bed late and waking up early so i haven't been getting my complete eight hours of sleep that my body needs but i just can't sleep because i have so much to do i have so much on my mind anyways we're talking about the lashes so this is what the lashes look like girl did her thing as per usual my lash tag she's always gonna eat i want to try mega volume i've always been getting volume lashes from her simply because my lashes are so thin and i've been so scared to really try the mega volume but yeah so i want to actually relax my leave out because as you guys can see the leave out and my extensions are two different texture like you can literally see that my hair is becoming natural especially at the root don't mind my edges y'all my edges are literally growing back they were way worse than this and that's one of the reasons why i've been taking a break from wigs because i want to work on my edges i haven't worn like a lace wig in a whole entire year y'all I didn't even realize it was that long but yeah i actually want to finish up the maintenance vlog today so today we're going to be relaxing my leave and we're going to be waxing the armpit i've been growing out the air under my arm so that i could wax it's giving caveman vibes underneath there we're gonna get that together what should i do first i'm gonna wax my armpits first and then we're gonna relax the hair Okay, 
okay, okay, okay, okay. Your girl is getting better at this waxing thing. Look at this, y'all. I only did two applications and I just have a little tad bit of hair underneath the upper part of my arm. I feel like these ones are too short. That's why the wax didn't actually catch these ones. I feel like my body is getting immune to the pain because it's not as painful anymore. I still dread the process of ripping off the wax, but you know, once I'm in the process of doing it, it doesn't feel that bad. I'm gonna finish waxing. All right, you guys, so I'm done with waxing my armpits. This is how everything came out. This is my left arm. This is my right arm. It's giving balls underneath my armpits, which is what I was going for. It honestly didn't feel that painful compared to when I just started waxing. If you want to do waxing at home, I'm not going to ever stop promoting them. They were the first brand to ever reach out to me and believe in me. I saw your girl at 500 subscribers and decided they are going to believe in my creativity and what I bring to the content creator space. So big up trust well for sending me my at-home waxing kit I still have it up to this day I think it's been what like a year now or so I still have like three whole bags of wax beads that I haven't used yet but I'm at like two packets of wax beads I'm definitely gonna go back on Amazon and reorder some wax beads if you want to do your waxing at home go check out chest wellness on Amazon and cop yourself an at-home waxing kit like get the wax beads get the popsicle stick the after and before waxing spray you get the wax pot everything anyways but right now y'all we're gonna start on my hair i already kind of took out my leave out and you know just separate it from my extensions because i'm gonna relax it right now i'm so hot y'all Whew, yeah like we're getting the summer heat are y'all seeing how red my eyes are this is crazy i can't believe i'm going back to work looking very sleep deprived i can see how red my eye is my eyes just feeling very tired but my body just feeling so energized my body doesn't feel tired my eyes and my body aren't in sync right now they aren't relating they aren't on the same page at all i'm gonna try to go to bed early tonight just so that i can get back into my routine not going to bed early because i've been going to bed like 12 1 clock the whole entire week anyways the relaxer that we're gonna be using today y'all is the oris olive oil hair relaxer and i've been using this relaxer for years i've never ever ever used another relaxer since since i was in primary school my mom relaxed my hair very early and that's why whenever i try to get my hair natural and work with my natural hair it's a struggle for me because i don't know how to deal with natural hair i've never had to deal with my natural hair since i was a little girl my hair has always been relaxed i remember that at one point when I decided that I'm gonna go natural it was such a struggle for me to find hairstyles to do to maintain my hair because I don't know how to do it I got fed up of it super easily and I was back to wanting to relax my hair and I just decided to stick to the evil that I know because at the end of the day I'm not gonna force myself to deal with something if I don't have to and I like my hair being relaxed but yeah this is what it's looking like I honestly thought I was getting the, the little bottle of olive oil hair cream I didn't realize that it was the tubes but I mean this this works i'm just relaxing like little sections of my hair i didn't even know olive oil hair cream had tubes i've always been getting the bottle kit so this is i guess the tube kit and this one is specifically to target small sections of your hair so like your edges your side or your back okay so it actually works so perfectly for my hair because i'm just doing my edges and this small section i have a bunch of these shampoo and conditioners from my last couple of kits that i bought so you get the cream base and you get the relaxer activator and then you also get a shampoo and conditioner So I have a relaxer in my hair y'all So I'm just gonna let it sit in there for 5 minutes I think that's good enough To kind of like straighten out my roots Because I really want my roots to be straightened The whole point of me relaxing my leave out right now Is so that I don't have to be putting too much heat on my hair I do not want to fry my leave out I am trying to get my edges back And I do not want to give my edges heat damage I do not want to cause any further damage to it With that being said I do not want to over process my hair I feel like it's safe to leave it in there for 5 minutes To actually get it to be straight and nice so that it can actually blend in with my extension i'm gonna set a timer siri set a timer for five minutes girl five minute girl timer counting down 
<laughs> Siri is so stupid. So while I wait for my hair to actually relax, I'm gonna go in the kitchen and kind of finish up on dinner because the girl is doing some fried rice with some barbecue chicken wings. I'm trying not to put things in the video that is not related to maintenance. And since cooking is not related to maintenance, I'm not gonna show that part. But anyways, I'm gonna go finish up some dinner stuff and then I'll come back when the timer is done and wash this out and you know, get my hair together. Alright y'all, so that uh, girl is all done with the relaxing process. I'm just gonna like towel dry my hair a little bit and then I'm gonna use the blow dryer to kind of like get it even more dry. I did kind of get the top portion of my tracks wet so I'm actually gonna go over that as well with the air dryer. I was wanting to flat iron my bundles but I'm just gonna leave that till tomorrow to be honest because I don't need to be doing it today and uh, I just wanna have my hair all fresh and straight for work on Monday. I'm just gonna finish towel dry my hair then blow it dry it. I'm gonna add some oil to it just to give it some moisture. This is a biotin premium hair oil. I'm just gonna add a little bit of that to my hair. Blow dry. <laughs> Yeah, my leave up blends way better. It's looking like the same texture of my extensions. If I have straight hair in, I like it to be blended with my extensions. I don't like my hair to be looking natural and the consistent flat ironing just don't do it for me because as soon as I go outside and a little bit of moisture or if I start sweating, my hair starts to go back into its natural state. Look at that, like I don't even have to put any edge control or anything in my hair for me to do my edges. That's what I like. Less effort, easy to mold. My baby hair is literally laying. Anyways, y'all, this is the end of the video. I'ma end this video off right here. Really love how everything turned out. Armpits waxed, lashes, everything nailed my hair like everything is giving we've come to the end of this maintenance vlog if you've enjoyed don't forget to like comment share and subscribe turn on that post notification so you can be notified whenever i post another video when you like the video it allows my video to be seen by other people it tells youtube that you guys are enjoying my content don't forget to like leave a comment as well if i just swallow a red heart like just leave a comment you don't have to say too much you know and your girl is very friendly i reply back as well so don't be too scared to talk to me in the comments <laughs> yeah i love you guys see you guys in the next one bye yeah yeah sometimes we laugh sometimes we cry but i guess you know now baby i took a half and she took the whole